Oh my god, it has been a while since I've done one of these tier lists. But today, we're doing a rather weird tier list. Since I still haven't got back my last astronomical, I decided to do a tier list on Peculiar Galactics. This is probably the weirdest tier in the game, considering it contains some of the best items, and also some of the worst. But regardless, we're going to rate all of them on the standard tier list format. Starting with the Scale Infuser. It's an infuser. It's a great way to start off a tier list when you're supposed to be rating them on effectiveness and sellers, but there's an infuser, so you're going in the infuser tier. Okay, let's get into the first actual item, the Rocket Fuel Refinery. This is basically the weaker version of After Image, which is nine we'll touch on later. But what it does is that it launches your ore forward at a high velocity, and it also negates like 10% of the upgrade. Uh, during that duration. The uh, duration is also cancelled out when you use teleporters or a momentum stopper. Also you cannot use this in conjunction with after with the um, after image. It's not, it's not after image, it's after shock. After image is the effect it gives. Overall it's pretty useful in setups but it gets beat out by the after image so I'm putting in the A tier. Alright, next up, Ninovia Mine. Probably the best Peculiar Galactic for no other reason than it gives an ore that's actually worth a damn. And it's also not too difficult to get. Mastermind's Lecture. This is a one tile long upgrade that does 1.89 times with like no catch to it. Uh, this one's going in the A tier just because it doesn't quite have the MPU needed to reach S tier, but it's still a good item. Now we go to the opposite of good items, Interface of Progression. Now this item does up to 1.95 times once you reach Reincarnation 1000. Now Reincarnation 1000 late game, not too hard to get, but you can also, well you get this thing at Prestige 10, so by that point your requirement is going to be over 1000, so once again another A tier item, but it's like a very weak A tier, it's very close to being B tier. High Polite Reality PSR. This item is probably the one of the most recent Peculiar Galactics to be added to the game. And it's not entirely good. It does a 3 times upgrade and gives the Teleport Velocity Preserver tag. This basically makes after image effects not get cancelled out by a Teleporter. And uh, yeah, Teleporter. Singular. It does not work with multiple Teleporters. And you can only use one of, the, one of them. So uh, yeah. Good item concept, but not very good. C tier. Still useful for getting your order out of a dimension and makes dimensions usable, but not too useful later on. Force to upgrade. If this was before the fix, this would be S tier, but since it got fixed, uh, this happens. Good luck using this to upgrade your ores. F tier. Euler's Eradicator. This item is ginormous for one, and it has an MPU of 1.9. Now, this is an item that has a reincarnation requirement that changes when you prestige. This one is especially bad because it is 1000 reincarnations above your prestige requirement. Unlike the after image and dimensional postcard, and I think Hyperlight Reality PSO as well, yeah, this one is not worth grinding for. So, uh,. D tier because it's still okay as an upgrader. It's just not really one that you're going to grind for. Dimensional postcard S tier. It preserves after image velocity. Very useful actually. Crate generator. This item generates crates. It is a that is it its purpose. Only problem is that you have to throw a million ores into it to actually get some value out of it. Now, at the start of the Halloween event, this thing was overpowered because the crater generators give 300 candy each. However, a day after the event started, it was that was uh, nerfed, so it didn't do that anymore. So, yeah, it's back to the FTF for you until something else comes out about it. All on screen, probably the weakest Peculiar Galactic in terms of being an actual upgrader. It does four times. You can get up to nine when you use the Void Well and everything bagel on it. But, uh... Yeah, that can do up to 2 MPU, but uh, it gives voided, and it's also a pretty low base upgrade, so... Another item that belongs... I'm going to put it in B tier, because it has potential to be a good item. 
it just you just need to have the statuses on it to actually make it good. And finally, the after image, which is the best uh, Piccoli Galactic. You are not going to see any High Life player not using this, unless they have like 15 Palinopsias, which uh, is very unlikely because there's a, there's a problem with Palinopsia. Uh, it's three tiles long. So you usually see people using one Palinopsia and probably like three or four after images stacked on top of it. And that is it for the Peculiar Galactic tier list. Let's just go over it one more time. We got Create Generator and Seal, which has gone all the way to the other side of my base as a testament to how bad it is. Use Eradicator in D tier. Hyperlight and Reality Piercer in C tier. All on screen in B tier. Rocket Fuel, Mastermind Lecture, and Interface of Progress A tier. And the Novia Mine, Dimensional Postcard, and After Image in the S tier. And that concludes my tier list on the Peculiar Galactics. Uh, maybe you found some value in this, or maybe you didn't. I have no idea.